When I married Don, he had four kids, two cats and a dog. And my friend said, are you nuts? <laughs> but clearly I was not because it's been 31 years. We did a lot of traveling and we were pretty active. And then I had a couple of small strokes and that is what then led to the diagnosis of AFib. That was troubling at first because I didn't understand exactly what it meant. Unfortunately, in 2012, I was also diagnosed with breast cancer. So there were a few years there where things were a little chaotic and hectic, but Don was a fantastic caregiver. He did things for me. He calmed my fears. He is a really good caregiver. He's a really bad patient. <laughs> Janice and Donnie have been my patients for many, many years. During one of her office visits, her husband Donnie talked to me about the fact that he was not feeling well. And when I examined him, I found that in fact he had developed atrial fibrillation, like his wife. I was fortunate because I knew about AFib through Jan's experiences and what the ablation process might be if it was needed. When it's my turn to uh, take care of him, there was all this, you know, you shouldn't be doing that. Oh, I think I can handle this kind of thing. Um, so. Stubborn is the word yes, that she uh, usually <laughs> uses. I am doing fine today. I am, I am able to fully physically do the things that I want to do. Having the cardioversions and the ablations has made a big difference. We still like to travel. We try to pretend that we're not as old as we are and do things that um, will keep us younger. As a doctor, I, I always was brought up to believe that my job was to make people feel better, live longer, and avoid the complications of the diseases they have. Jan and Don are an, the epitome of this. This is an example of where these patients are living a much better, superior quality of life. I don't take any of it lightly. I'm here, and I have great doctors, and I cannot thank them enough. We both are feeling better and doing better, and we look forward to the next day and the next day and the next.